morning everyone we are at Waro Bridge as you can see and we came here for camping mm -hmm. uh, Masha is living in India after 11 years staying here for the last visit in Meghalaya she asked us to take her for camping and Kintu chose this place and we will definitely miss Masha Get up. Good morning. Did you sleep well? I can't say much. We have a beautiful view. I don't think I slept enough because it's a new place. So. We will show you a little bit around. So? A good place to have camping because it's around the river. There is a beautiful bridge. You can smell after so long nature smell. It's just you want to breathe in and you don't want to breathe out. While everyone was sleeping, we decided to climb the bridge to meet the first rays of the sun there. As soon as we climbed the bridge, I understood why this place is so popular among tourists. Breathtaking view from both sides, crystal clear water. Oh, here is our camping. And the main one, bridge itself, which is beautiful from above and from the side and from below, we checked everything. By the time we came back, ladies were already awake. Good morning! <laughs> You all know Masha, uh, she's living after 11 years staying in India and I want to ask uh, what will you miss about India? I think I'll miss uh, people, different cultures, varieties and also food, sometimes spicy, sometimes make me cry, it makes me feel like dragon and places where I used to live, where I have lots of memories. I think all of us, we are wishing you all the best. Yeah, we will miss you in our vlogs. Thank you. <laughs> Actually, I wanted to start our vlog yesterday, but we came quite late and that was already dark. So I took only a few videos what we did. We started the journey about 12 p.m. and then stopped along the way to buy marshmallow and sausages to roast on the fire. And then one hour later, we stopped again to eat. Then we stopped to look at seven sister waterfalls. But since it's winter, we saw nothing. Then we missed our turn and accidentally so can ramp falls. So we arrived to the place we need was getting dark. There wasn't much to do, so we set a fire and started frying sausages. By the way, we had to pay 250 extra for the fire. For dinner we got rice, dal, chicken, potato and salad. Honestly, that was very tasty. So that was our evening, now let's go back to the next day. Let me show you a little bit around. The territory is not that big, but it accommodates a good number of tents. Here we have tables for dinner and breakfast, kitchen where they cook everything, pretty clean toilet and tub to brush and wash your face. So in this camp you are getting all basic stuff, whatever you need. But the most important, of course, it's you. I think most of the people would come here because of the view. Did you sleep well? Yes. Yes. No, no. Because she was staying late night yesterday. By the river. By the river, around the wind. Mm. And like, oh, I don't know what happened, but my little oh. hurts. <laughs> yeah. uh, here you get... Uh, bed sheet and pillow and blanket i think if you want to come here you can come for at least two nights to really mm. enjoy yeah. to the fullest and don't come late like us we made a mistake we had to come at least by three so there's three package 800 1200 and 1700 800 you get 
this stuff, but without food. 1200 you get food and then 1700 you get food plus boats and everything. Yeah. Okay, what's here? Two red tea, uh, four red tea, two milk tea, oil eggs, eggs and maggie. And maggie. Even though breakfast was included to our package, for Annie and Sasha that was too spicy, so they couldn't eat. After breakfast we decided to take a boat ride to enjoy the view from the river. Okay, it will not look very nice in pictures, but what to do? How orange color matches me? Good. Hello, let's go. ever come this place for camping make sure that you take a boat ride because it's worth it we paid only 150 uh, per hat but the view and that experience when you go in and it's like so quiet and peaceful really worth it this is очень классно здесь очень очень чистая вода ты плывёшь на очень большой глубине и можешь видеть эти камни внизу это просто очень классно i love it Epic. Maria? It was very peaceful. Nice. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Hello. People who are taking care of this place, they said that here is too deep. So we will go to swim that side. I'm good. Bye. <laughs> well, I hope I will get used to this. Close, 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 close. And relax, relax, relax. After that, we went to see Nokalekai, but that was very foggy and we saw nothing. Here is our view. It's like milk. Zero. Zero. And we finish our day by meeting our friends for coffee. And yep, we enjoy the food. And the next day was the last day for Masha and Sasha and Nikala. It's last few days. Um, today she's leaving Nikala and she will stay two days more in Dimapur and then two days in uh, Delhi and then she goes back to Russia and then new country is waiting. Let's go through some memorable moments which we had with Masha before we say goodbye. When we started we barely had enough <laughs> Пока, пока. Bye. Don't cry. I'm not crying. I know we will meet again. Bye. Birds that fly high, fish beneath the sea.